We're back at it again, guys. Cutting eggs and uh, exciting clutch here. A GHI pewter to a Firefly Arms Dream. Can't wait, guys, so stay tuned. All right, so like Ben said, GHI pewter to Firefly Orange Dream. GHI pewter is a GHI black pastel pastel, and Firefly is pastel fire with Orange Dream in it. So, got six uh, six jeans at play here. Mm-hmm. Six jeans and how many eggs? We got three eggs. So it's not a huge clutch. It was her first clutch, though. It is her. We produced her, which is cool. Yep. And. Uh, one really big egg. <laughs> Again. I wish I wish we would get a you know twin here at some point, but you never can't can't always uh, expect that. So we're gonna dive right on in. See what we got. All right. Now these are scheduled to pip tomorrow, but um, they're nicely dimpled. Yeah, we. Uh, we can get them a lot closer to that 60 day mark. So, before we cut, just to, in case. We got a. Is that normal? It's, I think it's a fire, which is wild. <laughs> yeah, with all the genes at play, to get a single gene is uh, kind of low odds, but. Pretty hard to hit just a fire in this clutch. Can. We're using a different lens now, so I'm hoping we're getting in closer. Yeah, somebody mentioned that we should be using a, a different lens. We do need to get that macro lens. We're working on it. They're only, you know, $1,000. I wish it was only $1,000. Well. 1300 bucks For the right macro lens, yeah. Let's see what we got here. This guy's about to come out. So that looks like that's a cool head stamp. That may be. Hmm. It's definitely fire. Might, might be a black. It's definitely fire, but maybe it's just a fire. I was thinking it might be black pastel fire, but no GHI. That's crazy. Our odds have been really great with GHI the last but couple you, of cuttings here. You can see, like obviously, this guy's ready to go he's already breathing yeah and he's out of his it's gonna pip any second yeah so we timed this one just right wow all right come on big egg come on big egg let's do something here we want some ghi orange dream stuff let's be real black pastel ghi orange dream stuff so that mm. is <clears throat> that is a OD GHI maybe pastel pastel OD GHI Wow that was look at that really big blushing hmm I'd like to see its head I don't know if I can see fire in that but it's super bright it might be it could be fire too it's definitely pastel G H I O D. Yep, I agree there. We'll know a little bit more when it comes out of the egg, obviously. Not to say something that everybody already knows, but <laughs> <laughs> just trying to see. It really has its head buried in there, so alright, we won't muck with it. That's yep. a pretty animal though. I'm excited to see how that colors up. Yep, yep. Cool. Very cool. So, um, we'll give you an update on these once they come out and shed. And, uh, I don't know, this is going to be a short video. We're going to have to sandwich this on something. <laughs> <laughs> we still have to show the parents. Oh, yeah. Let's show some parents. Yeah. Alright, so here's the sire for the clutch. This is a pastel black pastel ghi really cool we actually produced him as well mm -hmm. it's awesome when you get to the point where you're producing animals from animals that you produced multi-generational yep 
So Pins that's the mail. Are we going to be selling this one? I think we were talking about it. I think this is the last season with us, actually. I only, know. only thing is, we don't have a lot of black pastel in the collection. So, you know, I don't know. We're on the fence. For a male, I'd like it to have recessive at this point in our evolution here. R&B reptiles, but... <laughs> Um, we'll see. Mm -hmm. Here's the female. Beautiful firefly orange dream. Yes. She's a screamer. I love I'm how the to. OD softens everything up. Makes these cool orange blushing. Man. Orange dream's awesome. Mm -hmm. And she's for sale? Meh. <laughs> Not nope. just yet. We still have a place for her here. Absolutely we do. It's hard because you want to put recessive stuff in as much things as possible because, you know, recessive is all the rage. Everybody wants it. But also want to be able to keep part of the collection that is just cool codoms that we can mix together. And a lot of people are still out there looking for that. It's a, they usually are a little bit cheaper animal. So if you're getting into the pet side or just starting out into the hobby, that's usually where people start. So, but we only have a limited amount of space. It's really, it's difficult. <laughs> really need to start thinking about. Building a facility, yes. <laughs> Got it. <laughs> All right, thanks guys. Thank you. So this is uh, the clutch we just cut, which was the Enchi Inferno to a fire. And we thought it was gonna be a really easy to ID because we've done this pairing before, and uh, so far, we don't know what we're talking about. So, <laughs> to be perfectly honest with you, so, like we can pull some things out of here, like obviously, if you look at this belly, this is yellow belly, this is fire, uh, probably Enchi, probably Enchi yellow belly fire. Maybe. The so this is just a teaser because we're going to wait until all these guys shed to give you guys the real update but we are still at a loss for some of these it's probably a pastel yellow belly even though the yellow belly markings aren't as so show on show the, the couple crazy ones and then we'll we'll just leave like it at this one teaser to bite the crap out of me yeah and how about the one that wants to bite the crap out of you look at this <laughs> stop it you're so bad so we got this guy. Look at that head. Yeah. Yeesh. That is nuts. So this is yellow belly. Hidden Gene Wilma. It's gotta be. You would think this has to be everything. But we produced what we thought was that same animal before. It did not look anything like this. Some parts did, but not, yeah, not all of it. Not the dorsal. Not how tight this pattern is. That pattern's crazy. And once it sheds out, this is gonna be like super orange. Yeah, so one, when we when we talked about this before, we said we looked up the lineage and Look, pulled the parents and. This is what we thought we produced last year is an empty fire inferno. It has really bright orange sides, but the dorsal's not the same as that one. This was would be an empty fire inferno as well using the logic but it doesn't look anything like it it's very tough to say very tough to call and of course when they color up they start getting real dirty so but this is from that fire that we have that weird gene that we haven't tracked down yet yep so but, maybe but that fire there's an interaction maybe there is but as crazy as that it is we looked to see if we crossed it before um, so that that would be the super form hitting in here and it's not because the parents are unrelated to what we've had so you have something like that maybe there's no pastel in those I don't know it's really bright <laughs> it's hard to say look like if this is a firefly and this is a firefly see the heads so oh, maybe yeah. this is no pastel and there's would no pastel make that big of a difference it shouldn't that doesn't make sense that pastel would do that i don't know man let's just let's just wait until they all shut out and we'll we'll pull them together and see what happens 
That one's got to learn. <laughs> but then there's like that one too. Then you're going to go to the hospital. <laughs> both trying to bite you. We're getting bit. I mean, seriously though. Uh, focus. Look at that. I mean, it's just. That's definitely. Uh, I don't know. This is Hidden Gene Wilma, Fire, and she. Yellow Belly. I guess it's gotta be Yellow Belly. Yeah. See, this this one looks a lot like the father, like this one. This one looks a lot like this one. Okay. I don't know if you're seeing my hand. That to that. This one? Yeah. They look very similar. Like in the egg, that one looked like this one. So I'm with you there. But. We're going from a sneak peek until uh, let's show everything. Yeah, let's just do a sneak peek. All right. Because they still have to shut out. They have color that they have to color up. It's just we are really thrown off by this clutch. It's got to be pasto and she yellow belly. Maybe it's fire too? <laughs> Definitely pastel and she yellow belly. Look at that mm. head. I know. The head stamps on this clutch Super are nice nuts. and clean though. Mm hmm. And I know you're hungry because we're feeding today. All the hidden gene Wilma stuff seems to have an attitude. I love it. <laughs> For a little while, not this guy. This guy's doing great. Yes, I see. I'm going to put him back, actually. This one has a really nice definition. Look at that. What is that definition? <laughs> it's the definition of... Uh... All right, sneak peek, man, sneak peek. Come on, they still have the color up. Let, let's, let's let this go. I know we're real confused, and we want everybody's help. Guys, if you watch our videos, you know we suck at this. We're amateurs. <laughs> That's not true. We, we, can't do, we can't ID anything. We do well IDing stuff, and then something like this happens, and we start to reconsider everything. <laughs> These noodles are, like, trying to kill each other. Got it? I think so. All right, let's put this guy back. And we keep them all together, keep them humid um, until they all shed out. So yeah, we're gonna have a contest. Who can ID <laughs> that clutch? <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, I'm gonna close it out with the pastel lorry that we have. This girl laid and we are just dying for these eggs to be ready to cut um, to see what, what we get. We're only a couple weeks away. We're only a couple much. weeks away. Yeah, I can't wait. So this is the Pastel Lori. Looks amazing. Obviously you can tell that it's not just Pastel and the influence of Lori as they get older is just awesome. Um, beautiful animal. I know a lot of people have been excited about the Lori stuff. Uh, just look at all this crazy. I think we'll be able to call Lori stuff a lot easier than the Royo stuff lately. Um, but she's just beautiful. I'm really excited to see what eggs come out of our incubator that she produced, as well as some of the other Lori stuff that we got going on. But thank you so much for watching, guys, again. And we really appreciate your support. Please hit that like button down below if you like this video. And also hit that subscribe button. It helps us out a lot. Also, watch Her Palace Rock. We got a lot of stuff going on. You can listen to it. You don't have to watch it on YouTube. I know YouTube doesn't like to hear that, but you can watch it. You can also listen to it. We so you know, it's something for everybody. But we're going to feed this girl and get her going. Uh, she's been eating, so it's not like she hasn't eaten. But today's feeding day. So here we go. See you guys later. And grab the female out of here who always wants to bite me. Come on. You're good. Dang, no bite. Wish. And these ones are going to be the ones that come out. This is the yellow belly. Yeah. Yellow belly. So, <laughs> maybe it's just to yellow preface belly. this. Hey, these all came out of the egg. This is a teaser. Uh, I thought I was just having the conversation with you. Apparently, we're shooting some video here. Just real quick. So. Uh,